So you're thinking about buying a pug? Before you do, hold your horses. Watch this video all the way through so you can avoid a lot of misery and unexpected medical bills. Hi, I'm veterinarian Nielsen Schrever and I help cat and dog owners avoid sudden sickness and high medical bills without the long waiting times and stress. And so Dr. Google doesn't give you a heart attack. <laughs> if you'd like to avoid medical or behavioral problems for your fur baby, be sure to click the subscription button below and hit that bell button so you get notified every time I release a new video. When it comes to choosing your new best friend, you better choose correctly because most dogs yeah, they tend to stick around for about 10 years or more, especially small dogs like a pug. First of all, you need to know if a pug is right for you and you need to find a good breeder. I will help you with both of those things in this video. Quick intermezzo! I wrote a book a while ago and I just translated it to English so it can be available for everyone all over the world. It's available now on Amazon. It's called Choose Your Pet Like a Vet for dogs. Most breeds are in here. You can check out which character is good for you, good for kids or not, good for other animals or not, and especially what afflictions they are prone to. What you will also find in this book is how to avoid a bad breeder of dogs. Be sure to check it out and at the end of this video I might have a surprise for you guys. Just like in my book, I will be going over these five categories to tell you all about the pug. The pug's character. A pug is sociable, willful, playful, docile and sensitive. He is mostly quiet in the house, but he can be very cheerful and active. For his behavior, he adapts very easily to your lifestyle, so that's quite a plus. He doesn't take much work at all, brushing once a week is more than enough. His education should go easily. His exercise in possibilities are quite limited. This is because of his shorter snout, we call them the brachycephalic dogs, and they cause a lot of problems. I have a whole explanation about this in my book, so be sure to check it out because you can avoid a lot of medical problems by knowing about this problem. Most pugs also snore, and not only when they're sleeping. But if it's very bad, they snore all the time and can get very loud. This can be uh, disturbing and annoying, but a lot of people find this cute. Now, from a medical standpoint, I do not find this cute. This is actually a problem for his well-being. I don't like it at all. Sorry for all you pug lovers. Don't mean to step on any toes. I care about the dog's health. More about the health uh, and possible conditions that they hereditarily get very often. So you need to check if the parents of your pup have this problem as well to give him the best and longest life possible, especially the healthiest life possible. In addition to breathing problems, he also easily get cataracts and his eyes bulge out a little bit more, so they are prone to them popping out. So another scruff a pug, don't scruff any dog ever, by the way, it's just not, don't do it, it's, it's yeah, there's never any reason for scruffing a dog. Also with a pug, if you scruff him, he might get out of breath and not get enough oxygen, his tongue might actually turn blue. Which is scary. Skin problems, heart problems and Lichtpertes calvi are also common. With that last one, the neck and the head of the femur joint melt away, causing severe pain and arthritis and often the femur head needs to be removed. Nowadays they do have artificial hip joints for dogs but they are super expensive. You can expect a pug to live up to 13 to 14 years old. So that's all about a pug. If you've had any value from this video be sure to give it a like so more people can benefit from this information. So about the surprise I have for you guys. I've kept aside five paperback versions, so not ebook versions, paperback versions that one of you can win. All you have to do is be subscribed to the channel, hit the notification bell, like the video and leave a comment below to have a chance to win one of these books. The subscribe is completely free and I will be giving away more and bigger prizes the more subscribers are on this channel. So be sure to stay subscribed to have a chance to win anything in the future. Let's keep your fur babies happy and healthy together and I will see you in the next video.